In this video, let's take a look at deleting legend items. So if I don't want to show this required lot setback in this legend, and I added this by right-clicking this setback line, I can simply put the cursor over it, right-click, and choose delete. So the cursor can be over the text or the line, either way, and Traverse PC will delete that from the legend and automatically resize the legend. But what if I try to delete one of these symbols that got added to the legend automatically. So let's try to delete this uh, found one inch iron pipe from the legend and see what happens. I'm going to choose delete and Traverse PC simply comes back and says I have to have that symbol in there because it's being used but I'm going to put it back in with its default text. So you lose your modified text and you don't get rid of the symbol. So here's how I would rather do that. Let's go ahead and uh, type in that text that we want, that we lost. So if I don't want to show this, what I want to do is hide it. Okay, I'm not going to see it in the legend, but it's still going to be there. So it's not going to automatically delete it and then reinsert it again with the default text. It's simply going to say, I want to hide that. Now, we can learn about hiding and showing objects in a drawing, but I'm going to come over here to the toolbar and say, I want to show the hidden objects. So there's my found one inch iron pipe. And if I want it back in the legend, I can right click it, tell Traverse BC I want to show it, and it'll be back in the legend. But remember that uh, if the legend is set to use automatic symbols, let's just show that to you here real quick. That's just setting right here at the top that says automatic point symbols. If a symbol is used in the drawing, Traverse BC has to put it in the legend. So if you delete it, it'll stick it right back in. 